by 11. They took the lead and actually had a three-pointer right at the end by Aaron McKee. Put the 76ers right where their name is. 76 Very good. You are a Sharpie. Well, I was there when they became the 76ers. <laughs> I know that. Yes, sir. Moved from Syracuse, right? Yes. Start of the fourth quarter. Philadelphia by three. Iverson gets baseline. Well, gets the bucket. around Dragon Tarlot and still made it back in the arena. Sixers by five. Brand nearly had it stolen from behind by Iverson. Look at it, right? Hoiberg does for three. Brand snares the rebound. Hoiberg another three. Jermaine Jones retrieves. Can't ask for any better shot than no, that. That's what you want. Straight on out. Sixers on top by five. Iverson looking to make a move on Mercer. Off the glass wouldn't go. Tarlett steers the rebound to Drew. Bulls have numbers if they hurry. Hoiberg fills the lane. Left it short. Knocked out of bounds. It'll belong to Chicago. I think he got hit on the back of the head, but the only thing is the Bulls ball. Pepe Sanchez in for. Is that Jermaine Jones leaving? Jermaine Jones is leaving to bring someone else for him. Theo Ratliff, Theo Ratliff leaves. So, or Theo Ratliff comes in. And Hill leaves for Philadelphia. Haven't seen much of George Lynch. He's normally a starter on the front line of the 76ers. Hoiberg gets the start. Oh, the jam! Ready on a jam. He hurt his ankle again, though. Look at the way he came down. Fred has been hounded by injuries his couple oh, of seasons here. That ankle has really given him a problem. Iverson Travel. slipped. He traveled with the ball. Turns it over. So Freddie says, I'm gonna, I'm gonna see if I can stay. But he's got it. 12 turnovers Fred's for the 76ers. In, yeah. And one for him. And dunks it. A little and buggy with Yeah, it came down at, at Left ankle kind of funny, and they were going to take him out, but coach says, let him stay, let him stay. Whitley gets there. Tarlatz deep. And gets the bounce. Tarlatz comes up with his first points of the game. Bulls down by just one. Almost two minutes gone by in the fourth. They spread the floor. Iverson creates. Sanchez, late delivery to Ratliff in traffic. Bulls clock the lane and come up with a steal. Ron Mercer to Bryce Drew. Hoiberg off the wing on the baseline. Oh, that one was down too. Iverson to the fall away. Tarlach is there. All right. Bulls can take the lead again. Drew. He's got to get a little, a little offensive. He's going to take the shot, but there he goes. The back cut by Mercer didn't get the call on the drive. Yeah, I didn't get the foul. Looked like he hung long enough to get it, but. Aaron McKee into and the lane, lost, lost the handle. Drew on the run. He's got Brand on his left. Oh. Foul by McCullough. Good play. Bryce Drew giving it to the big man. The big man's going to try to go over McCullough, who's 6'10", but he's going to take it all the way in. You know Brand's not going to pull up for that jump shot. So two free throws here by Elton Brand. Here it is. Okay, he's got it. Man on the left. Here it comes Elton Brand. And he will shoot two free throws. Brand to take this. Bulls lead back again. 11 for Elton Brand. Heel of the rim on the first, so he can tie the game here. Glasses back on for Larry Brown. Ah! 76ers basketball. They still lead by one and dodge the proverbial bullet there. Pepe Sanchez. Iverson setting a screen at the moment. A little screen roll. Look for that. Sanchez to McCullough. Five to go on the shot clock. Sanchez elevates. Rebound, Ratliff with authority. Theo Ratliff inside. Yeah. 
Sixers by three. Brand working hard trying to get loose on the block. Elton back to the basket. To the right hand. Nicely done. Nice little soft shot. 13 for Big E and the Bulls down by one. 80-79. Almost four minutes gone by in the fourth. Sanchez. Iverson got inside position on Mercer. McCullough. McCullough has been murder all night. Goes up high on the board to get that rebound. He's got 13 rebounds in the game. Six, six off the offensive glass. Exactly. He took the words right out of my mouth. Bryce Drew. Under eight minutes to go in the game. Brand picked up on a switch by Sanchez. Quick ball movement from the outside. It won't go for Hoiberg. Iverson. Whirls. And a foul coming up. We're going to get a timeout. Iverson. Ratliff over the back, almost a foul. Ran a good position of the rebound. The Bulls still trail by just three. Coming up on 7.20 to go. Brand. Over Hill. Elton Brand with a second from the field here in the fourth quarter as 15 in the game. Again, Brand played 45 minutes last night. He missed a couple of free throws moments ago, and sometimes that fatigue that sets in there. Uh, he's a big, strong kid. Yep. Tarlach. Ratliff uh, was bumped by Tarlach, and Dragan picks up his third person. It's two on the team. Not shooting a fair. Kukoc back on, replacing Sanchez for the Sixers. This is the perfect way to play back-to-back, -to, -back, to sleep in your own bed. You know, oh, absolutely. One and you, you stay here and you get them both at home. This is the only back to back with both at home for the Bulls this season. McKee to the fall away. Oh, he created some space there. And now he now has 18. 76ers by three once again. Brand against Hill. EB goes baseline. Knocked out of bounds. Last touch by the Sixers. Eight to go on the shot clock for the Bulls. Bryce Drew on the trigger. Five to go. Our test. Mercer from deep. Back catch rebound to McKee. There's some length on the floor for the 76ers now. At every position but this one. But this is where they don't need the length. This guy is unbelievable. Allen Iverson with 27. And all of a sudden, it's a five-point lead. Bulls are going to take a timeout here. Almost halfway through this fourth quarter, the Bulls trying to hang with the best team in the Eastern Conference. Allen Iverson of the Philadelphia 76ers lead 86-81, but it's far from over, according to Elton Brand and the Chicago Bulls. Uh, Dan Rowan, earlier I mentioned Elton Brand a couple of missed free throws. Sometimes that tells you the guy's getting tired, and that's not the case, is it? Well, I was eavesdropping way into the huddle, and Tim Floyd looked right at Elton and said, are you tired? He said, no way. In fact, then Tim drew a play on the chalkboard there, and I think they're going right back to the Big E down on the block right here. Well, they come back and go a little bigger, Dan. Uh, Ronnie Artest back in the lineup. Fred Hoiberg and Mercer. Elton Brand up front with uh, Michael Ruff. The inbounds to Mercer. Halfway through fourth quarter, Bulls trailing by five. There's Brand. Sixers increase the uh, intensity defensively. Now Elton Brand goes to work against Hill. Kukoc helps out and makes the steal. Brand trying to pass out of the post. Iverson. Picked up by Mercer. Rattler. Whirling. On Ruffin. Boy. Good shot there by Theo Ratliff. He has 12 points. Five twenty-two to go in the game. Sixers now lead by seven. Mercer trying to shake loose. Against McKee. Mercer a little up and under. Left it short. 
Rebound battle, and the lengthy Sixers come away with it in the person of Tony Kukoc. All right, they got uh, a seven-point lead here, and they just are going right to the basket. You not only need a stop, you need a score. 8-0 run now by Philadelphia, 29 for Iverson. And the Sixer lead is nine. Our test slips and falls. Gives it up. Knocked out of bounds. Oh, hang on. Timeout taken by Philadelphia as the uh, ball was captured in play by Iverson. Big win for DePaul. Yeah, last second three point field goal. So this is the third game in this building here today. What a day. Iverson. Crucial juncture in the game here. Four and a half to go. Ratliff. Got it. Theo Ratliff with 14. Sixers by 11. 10-0 run by Philadelphia. Brand somehow able to gather it in. Our test at the arc had it for a moment, didn't take it, and lost the handle on it. Nolan Iverson back the other way. Our test commits the foul. This is fourth, third on the team. Four minutes straight up to go now in the game. The Bulls haven't had a sniff at a basket here uh, in the last three, four minutes. Sixers really put the clamps down defensively. Only two teams have reached 100 points against the Philadelphia defense this year, and that was one of them was Dallas last night. Iverson with a long deuce has 31 points, and the Sixers enjoy a 13-point advantage. Brand. Solo against Hill. Oh, pretty good defense by Ty Tyrone Hill on that play. Those are not even getting good shots. Iverson picked up by Artest. Under three and a half to go for the game. Ten to go on the shot clock. Iverson, oh, what a move to get to the lane. Oh, boy, that's a miss. The crowd loves it. And he just was challenged by, uh, by Ron Artest and went right at him. And, and you pointed out many times, our test is no slouch on the defensive side of the floor. He's a good defensive player. Mercer to Hoiberg, driving on Iverson, gets the step, beats Ruffin, slicing in, missed at point blank range. 14-0 run by Philadelphia. Has blown this one open. Under three minutes to go. Well, they got 32 points in that last quarter, 13 here. Hill had an open uh, look down low, but Ruffin took it away. And a foul coming up. Timeout taken on the floor. I believe the foul is on the key. Eight assists to go with his 33 points. And shooting better tonight. Normally he shoots around 39%. Much better than that tonight on 12 of 25. 238 to go, and the Bulls inbound facing a 15 point deficit which equals the biggest lead for the 76ers here tonight. Mercer on the inbounds. Knocked out of bounds away from uh, Ruffin. It'll belong to the Bulls. Well, they're apprehensive. Drew was open the first time, but uh, Mercer didn't look to him. Bryce Drew. Picked up by Iverson. Artest wants it on the block. Kukoc playing him tough defensively. Eight to go on the shot clock. Mercer. Down to three to go. Drew got it off in time. The runner off the glass. Brand the rebound and the putback. 17 for Elton Brand. Brand with 12 rebounds, 17 points. He also has seven assists, which equals his career high. Coming up on two minutes to go for the game. Kukoc. The Bulls down by 13. Kukoc backing Mercer. And it knocked away. Here come the Bulls out of the backcourt, and a foul called on Theo Ratliff. His fifth, third on the team. 86-83 over the Bulls. The Bulls uh, did not let the Sixers coast in this one. They got down by 15 in the third quarter, battled back, took a brief lead in the third quarter, nip and tuck till the mid portion of the fourth, and the Sixers put together a 14-0 run. The key for three was time winding down to the shot clock. Over the back, Tyrone Hill commits the foul on Elton Brand. 
Yeah, we'll walk the other way with 120. Uh, Elton Brand will shoot two free throws. Bulls trailing 96-85. Iverson. Whirling toward the lane. Like a pinball, it ricochets out of bounds. It'll belong to the Bulls. Good move by Bill Berry. <laughs> he has to get out of the way of that one. He still has they're some all quicks. Laughing. They're all laughing at him, too. He still has some quicks about him. <laughs> I think Greg Tedeschi says, you're on your own. Bryce Drew for three. Air ball. Retrieved by Elton Brand. In on Kukoc. No, but he'll go to the line. Elton Brand the rebound. Sixers leading 97-86. Our test takes the three. Bring it up. Nine for Ronnie Artes. A great effort and uh, the foul by the brace crew on the foul, yep. I guess. So we'll walk on down, see what happens. Coming up on 30 seconds to go in the game. Everyone's played for the Bulls except Marcus Pfizer in this one. Steal by the 76ers. Under 30 seconds to go. Sanchez, who coach outside as well. Now they'll look to run a little offense. Seven to go on the shot clock. Who coach inside. Left it short, didn't finish. Here comes Bryce Drew in the final seconds of the game. Crawford hoists a three. Almost made it on the bank. Bryce Drew steps back. Good if it goes. It is a two. It is good. Bryce Drew makes it a 99-91 final in favor of the Philadelphia 76ers. The Bulls fall to 3-21, and 1-10 and at home. The Sixers, 18-6, and six, best record in the East. They are 11-4. Incredible, 11-4 on the road. Our next Bulls telecast for Chicago.